welcome on my solar system we're looking at an uh, well a very customized system already after I don't know about 20 tutorials so what we'll do now is we'll um, try and, and see if uh, we can make a specific theme like the arc the red theme and the arc evo pop let's figure it out together how to make an other arc theme based on another color so away google arc theme colora the github of eric dubois and there you will find more explanations let's put that here and let's scroll down you just read go ahead and you see that everything works fine it has been tested on linux mint on ubuntu uh, i think even on on tergos well many systems the only thing you have to do is you have to figure out what elements differ for instance we don't have an apt get in the source so okay let's see what we can do let's git clone this thing a good way to tell you that there is an interesting way to download information from the net specifically specifically from uh, github we git clone something and then we paste this behind git clone oh yeah double git clone you see so just copy paste the command is already given you can't git clone git clone it was just double if at some point in time github is too slow what you have to do just control c arrow up and down again and you will see in a few times it will speed up even now it's quite slow the next one is this one we're gonna need that one as well so the first one is the source this is the source from horse 3180 so he makes amends he makes changes he makes gets out bugs and all that and the rest now what we're going down now is based on voilà, is the themes the colora scripting thing so we're going to uh, let these scripts loose on the new icon theme from first let's have a look so this is here this is here let's put these guys on the desktop so we don't have a folder open so this is the way we work you can read all about it but actually you just go from one to seven you copy paste this thing and once it's pasted you actually don't need the other folder anymore what we're gonna do now is well decide what color we're gonna have so I really don't know so um, let's take a look together at our possibilities we have a certain orange which is an orange kind of thing maybe we go for an orange look which would be actually best since there is a lot of orange also in sardi sardi mimix colora is blue we could go for blue um, we could go for sardi monocolora orange again and there is also well other possibilities as well also orange so there are a lot of oranges so maybe i think the best thing to do is to create it for an orange icon theme let's say we are creating it for sardi flat colora okay um, i need to know what color this is and what problem what what possibility do we have we have here a color picker i think it was uh, g color 3 the name i think we can see it here somewhere it says 3 i don't know why it's 2.1 it says but it's it's actually 3 i know it's via the installation name i think so we're gonna use this one and we're gonna hover over these elements and there you go this is your orange code so okay i'm gonna copy this code and let's maybe keep it open that can be closed that can be closed all right so we know what color it's it's gonna be we're gonna change the color you just read ahead this is the main thing new color copy paste save change only this code no hashtag before color code so i've done that save 
get rid of it and let's now run every single script type a dot a slash a one and tap and we have started just read the text yeah in, in this case it was written for ubuntu and linux mint and all that so it would be sudo P and e o p k g i t and then g color three i think it is let's have a quick look we have to wait anyway so um i'm wait for it okay now it is done so let's look um so sudo pc or i'm better maybe to do for e o p k g and then i t and then g color and something else voila number three strangely enough it says it's number two uh no i'm not gonna delete it next up is script number two quickly done next up is script number three make assets there's a problem probably let's see problem problems Control c Control c render assets of the png we have a program that does not exist in our system so it gives us uh, trouble. What we do is we install again it and then opt and then we stop typing and press tab. And there you go. So we have a same program, the same name was not yet installed. So now it is is installed, and you can run the script again. Nope, not that one. We've done that already. Oh, we can do it again because there were some. Uh, here you saw that some of the icons were created, so let's delete it. Start from scratch again, and then three. Make the assets. So now no errors anymore. You can go into the folder GTK2 and see what's going on. Uh, wrong folder. GTK2 assets, and he's actually creating all these little. PNG files coming from a bigger main element and this is our let's open it yeah this image view is okay not too heavy so we have changed already the blue kind of uh, arc icons from arc to, to orange icons so that's already in order also the assets dark everything is, is already ready but you still need to extract all these elements and render it to become a PNG I'm gonna wait for the script to end. Okay, the script has finished. So script number four to install the themes. Just to check, arrow up, we've just just finished number three. So what's next is number four, final installation. If there are errors here now on your system, that's because part of your system is, is missing some, some programs. I'm going to post that on the article, if that's the case, you can add those programs with a sudo EO, EO, PKG, IT and then everything else. So we have created the icon theme, we don't see it as of yet. Now there's a lot of stuff you can do. So this was number four. Number five is moving and renaming the themes. So I like to to do everything automatically otherwise i have to edit everything so the thing i do now is think how am i gonna call this one for everyone's sake i think it will be easier to call it just orange so it's gonna be called arc orange arc dark orange arc darker orange okay that's that that's done it's already in the hidden folder themes you can already stop i'm not gonna stop here i'm gonna uh, go one up so that was number five number six is actually the cleanup because of the how the script from Horst is built is that you, we have overwritten the blue elements and they're all orange so I'm gonna clean it up again everything is gone from the user share themes and now I'm gonna recreate the blue one the last blue one from github the most recent the most best one without bugs and, and all that the latest one is now available on our system with the names arc arc dark and arc dark so a blue version but a better version a more recent version everything done 
let's see you can uh, what can you do you can delete all of this don't need this where are the files the files are don't need that either the files are in here let's take a look they are in the themes here we have our darker orange our dark orange and arc orange let's quickly select them and see if we like it or not so here we have our choices i straight go for dark orange and there you go you have now this system that gives us the everything in dark except this little program it's always the same the tweak manager is not happy with what i do it keeps uh, on popping up blue but then that's the only thing that stays blue all the rest looks normal how about this yep panel so well this one ah here we have another one so i'll have to dig in and look at uh, the code where this little bugger is this blue little color is and add it to the script so it's also orange but nevertheless just two things that are uh, not uh, out of place let's say all the rest you see is now orange and it looks quite quite nice if you like orange of course so you can make any of the 60 million colors with this script enjoy